Mr. and Mrs. Harris. Welcome to Billing. Can you tell me what you remember, Martin? Has anybody been looking for me? There is no Martin Harris. He doesn't exist. What? Thrills and spills and psychological catches. Get off the truck! I think the story is very surprising. I saw myself seeing it in the theater. It's definitely a psychological thriller, but there's action in it. It's a nail biter, because you really don't know what's gonna happen. And the final twist, you can't figure it out. Get your hands off! When they tell you, oh, that's what happened. I'm Martin Harris. Action. I play a character called Martin Harris. He arrives in Berlin with his wife to give a lecture. Oh, welcome to Berlin. He gets involved in an accident. There are no rules with severe trauma of this kind. Memories get lost or fractured. He then discovers that someone has taken his place, another Martin Harris. Liz. Do I know you? What's wrong? It's me. Your husband. Martin. You are Dr. Martin Harris? Last time I looked. And that's what makes the film so exciting, is that he keeps thinking, this isn't amnesia. I know I'm this person. I totally locked into what this character was going through, this amnesia, to kind of almost become a baby again, and that you don't have a memory. And you're saying words that you don't quite know where you got the words from. Liam Neeson was the top of my list. I've always admired his work. It was a dream for me to work with him. This man is not Martin Harris. I am Dr. Martin Harris. He's the gift that keeps on giving. <laughs> After seeing Taken, the audience roots for him so much, you just really want him to succeed. You want him to win. Liam's a lovely man. He's a very professional actor, and he gives a lot, and it's been a real pleasure being able to work with him. He's a big man, so the scenes where he has to be intense, he can be quite threatening. He's flanked on either side by two very, very beautiful actresses. January Jones plays this kind of icy, cold, calculating wife. We're not really sure if she was a bad guy or a good guy. I thought that that was something unusual and interesting for a female character. I love you. The anchor was beautiful, sexy, stylish. She had to be with Liam through all the action, and she was keeping up like the best. Also had the chance to work with one of my dearest and oldest friends, Aiden Quinn. We have quite an extended fight sequence, but there's nothing better than doing that with the best friend. It's been a long time since I was in a kind of a thriller like this. Martin, we have a great cast. Oh my God, look at you. How are you doing? What are you doing here? Well, you called me. It's an international group of actors. It's what this sort of thriller should be like. Whoever's been doing this, they've been planning it for some time. The great Bruno Gantz. I was so thrilled to work with him. The question is, why would they want to take your place? I would do every movie with Bruno Gantz. I really like that this amnesia and identity cries is playing in Berlin in a twin city was, was separated. This is the city for this story. It's perfect. To shoot an American film in this city, that's a wonderful thing. There's gonna be a great deal of tension throughout. Welcome to the tour! I think the audience will appreciate the fact that it's not predictable. This one will be interesting to see it next to an audience when they find out all these extraordinary things in the last half of the movie. It's got a lot of action in it. I mean, there's some big explosions and some fights and gunshots and the things that I like to do in the movies. It's just cool. You really don't remember, do you? I didn't forget everything.